Yes, my fans. This is your boy Bonnie again, and I am in the kitchen. And today, I am about to cook some corn porridge. So, as I said, follow me, like, share, comments, and subscribe to the channel. So, what I'm about to do now, I'm gonna show you three corn. So. That is three corn where I'm gonna strip to make the corn porridge. So I'm gonna strip off all these grain and I will come back to you when I finish. So follow me. Yes, my fun. So as I was saying, this is this is the tree corn that I've just showed. It becomes thick now. So that's gone into the bin. That's gone into the bin. And this is what I get from the tree corn. So now I'm gonna put the pot on the fire now. Yeah. So just a little bit of water. And I'm gonna get a bit of cinnamon into it. Piece of cinnamon. Into it. So now I'm gonna stop this video a lot because I don't want this video for too long. I just want to show the best part. So now I'm gonna cook this for half an hour. Half an hour. So this is it going in. That is a con going in. Get out of the star. I am gonna cook that corn for half an hour. So I will come back what time now? Nine o'clock in the morning now. So 9.30, I will come back and you will see me. Catch up. Yes, my fans, as I said, the corn is cooking nicely. So the corn is cooking nicely. So what I'm gonna do now, as I'm cooking corn porridge, I'm gonna mix out two spoon of flour to thicken the corn. So I'm not using self-raising flour. I'm using plain flour. So I'm gonna use two spoons. And I'm gonna drop a bit of salt in it. Now I'm gonna mix that out. And when you put this in, you have to keep stirring it until when you boil back up.
after a liquid. Keep stirring that until it boils back up. That's it, don't go lumpy. So, this is a mini corn porridge, but is the corn that grow in the garden? So you can grow your own corn, you don't have to go and buy, buy a mini. I have lots of corn out there in the garden, you can just break one or two or three. This is the UK and we love to plant things. But I love to plant things because in the garden right now I have carrot, I have cucumber, I have pumpkin, I have sweet corn, I have cabbage, I have callaloo. Trust me, my garden is very fruitful. Very fruitful. Very, very fruitful in my garden. Yeah, this is coming together nicely now. Yeah. I love to eat what I grow. Because I know what I grow is natural. No fertilizer. Everything is natural. Straight from the soil. I'm a porridge man, I love porridge. I make all different type of porridge. I make pumpkin porridge, I make rice porridge, I make plantain porridge, I make banana porridge, I make oats porridge. Trust me, I'm a porridge man. I make cocoa porridge. You know that hard drip cocoa where you get from Jamaica, that black drip cocoa? That produces nice porridge. Trust me. You can grate the cocoa and the green plantain together. And I tell you, that is a nice porridge. Cocoa and plantain. The other day I do green banana and plantain. That was wicked. Yeah, so I'll come back to you later and I get my fun. You can see what's going on. Yes, my fans, let me show you. Let me show you, my fans, what the porridge look like now. See it there? See it there? You can see the corn, them look. Here is the corn grain, them, my fans, look at that. Wicked. Yeah. 
them all. This coming nicely. It's like Amini corn porridge. Straight from the garden. Look at the corn grain them. You see, this is the young corn. This is not the hard, tough corn. This is very young. So I just cut them straight off of the stick. Let me show the stick again. So this is what the corn stick look like. Very young corn them. And I just cut let my knife and just cut them off. Yeah. And then you just mix out two spoon of flour and put in there to give it the body. And it's a wicked breakfast. I'm gonna sweeten this now. So let me get my stuff. Yes, my friend. So why have here some vanilla spice, some nutmeg, some sweet milk. I put some salt in it already. Oops. One and a half of that vanilla spice. Let me give it a good stir now. Drop the knife. That's the minute you would mine on my life for just do my thing like this. And straight in it goes. Yes, my fans. So as I said, this is the boy bunny, and I'm doing some amini can porridge. But my amini grow in my garden, so I produce my own amini. You can do the same thing, or you can buy the can. But you don't want the tough can. You want the young. You want the young can. You want the young can. Yeah, you want a very young con. Yeah, a very young con. And you just cut them off. 
and make your porridge. So basically what I'm trying to say, you don't hard surviving life if you know how to. But a lot of people think that they don't have money. The, the pot can't go on the fire. A lot of people think if they don't have money, the pot can't go on the fire. But you can take anything, turn your hand, and you ain't me there. So we know some people that are Jamaica, I had a country, and then I do this. But you see me? You don't want them guys to turn my hand to anything. I remember when I was in Jamaica, hard life hit me. Put on a pot of fire. I'm going to cut some ripe plantain, about six ripe plantain, and put it in the pot. One of my cousins come here and see it. And the man laughs after me to shame. If man can't cook pea plantain. Yep. I come to England also, I had life lick me in England. And a white flour dump me cook with meatball and crush them and eat them. So I had life there everywhere in the world. Hey, don't worry about it. Remember to like, share, comment, and subscribe because this is the boy Bunny and I'm out. Catch you on the next video.